predominantly what I'm doing at the moment is running um, my sassy, awesome dance company, Neptune Girls, um, full of lots and lots of awesome women. Um, it's all about empowerment. empowerment. Um, it's a dance school, but we want everybody to feel welcome. So I always felt like with having sort of a platform, it's like you have a responsibility to do something good with it and mm. you can do something good with it and you can have an inspirational message and you can share that and it can be infectious and it can yeah. have a positive impact on people's lives. And I saw that happen in Most Wanted and for me, like that's the most fulfilling thing yeah. you could be doing. Yeah. Um, having a positive effect on other people's lives yeah. and inspiring them and um, teaching them how to inspire others. And I just wanted to do more of that with Neptune Girls, but um, I was really at a place where I was like, I just need to do me. I just need to be authentically me. Like, what yeah. am I about? What do? Yeah. What's the most important thing to me? Yeah, I do have a tendency to sort of push, 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 burn out. Push, 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 mm. push, burn out. And it's, I think a lot of people feel that it's that guilt around self-care, that yeah. sort of saying, I need to take this day just to breathe. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then it's feeling guilty because you've got pressures on you, you don't want to let people down. Um, yeah. But I think for me, what has helped is, is really getting true with who I am and what's important to me. Yeah. What am I about? What am I doing? To know how to, where to prior, prioritise my yeah. time. So I'm not just trying to do everything. Yeah. And I'm learning to delegate now. And that's, um, luckily I have an amazing team around me. Yeah, I'm so grateful for them. They've, it's just like they were meant to walk oh, into my life. Um, give them a shout out. So Olivia, Cheeseburger, um, oh. Grania Thompson, Aline Costa, um, Grace Hall and Sean Catterall. Um, Olivia and Grania have really taken more of like a leadership role within Neptune Girls and they're like my backbone. They yeah. just, they, they're just like, <laughs> they've made, made me, <laughs> oh. when I've dealt with myself because they believe in Neptune Girls so, so much. much. But we all do. Yeah. Like from the person that has an hour class and has never done it before, Mm. to me, who's been around for a couple of years, we all think, this is amazing. The spirit of it is amazing. It's a really safe place. Yeah, it has a life of its own. <laughs> yeah, totally, totally. But there was birth from mm -hmm. you and what you carried, I think. And that's what makes it amazing. It's like you really thought through what kind of spirit you wanted it to embody. And I, I feel like it's really carried itself through. Um, I just want to inspire more people to feel like they it's okay to be themselves authentically mm. and mm. and they're not broken that just to embrace I don't want to say like the beautiful mess that they are like we're not messes but I think we think of ourselves that way yeah. but just embrace ourselves meet ourselves where we are now yeah. Yeah. and then still own it I I definitely always want to be in the position mentally where I'm an eternal student and I'm always learning and growing and within myself. Um, <clears throat> there are some sort of challenges internally for me that I know sort of stop me and that whole playing small and hiding away. So I'd like to, personally, I'd like to overcome that for myself.